Hi guys, it's Monica, the Saving Minnesota Mama, and today I'm bringing you guys yet another makeup haul. It is the middle of July, and I am supposedly on my no buy July, which is not going over so hot, but that's okay. Um, I just picked up a few more items in the last week. Otherwise, I did purchase these within the last like month or so. Um, some of the things you guys have seen before, some of the things you haven't, but I have a few high-end things, and the rest is all drugstore or mass retailers. Um, let's get started. I will show you something that I purchased at Sephora that I absolutely love. And that is from Bite. It is the Agave Lip Mask. Um, if you're not familiar with Bite, Bite is made from food grade ingredients. So it is very healthy and natural and organic and you can eat your stuff if you would like to. Um, anyway, so this you put on, I put it on before I go to bed and I wake up in the morning and my lips feel amazing. Now, it, I did have it for a month and I have put a quite a dent in it, um, but I really, really like it. It has a very thick texture. It does smell kind of goofy at first and I really don't smell that anymore. So I know I've seen, I think, people have talked about that it smells, but um, mine doesn't really smell anymore or maybe I'm just used to the smell. But anyway, it is an awesome product. I would highly recommend picking it up. And if you are looking into more natural or organic um, lip, uh, lipsticks and lip pencils, I would definitely check out Bite. They do have a new lip mask, and I believe in the color Champagne or Champagne something. But anyway, um, I would like to try it. If you guys have tried it, please let me know in the comments below. Then from Too Faced, I had picked up the chocolate bar, which I um, posted a couple months ago. And in there, I picked up the blue eye primer, or it was actually the blue uh, packaging eye primer, which was the uh, neutral, the white, whatever you want to say, base. And I ended up repurchasing this from Sephora, and it is the champagne tone. It leaves a little bit of tone underneath my eyes, but I, this is the kind of tones I use with my eyeshadows anyway, so so it was perfect and a no-brainer for me to pick this one up but I really really like this eye primer it should last a long time um, I think it's $20 but I can't see myself repurchasing this anytime soon and then from Mac I was a Mac virgin until recently so thank you congratulations huh um, so I picked up two lipsticks and I picked them up in the color angel and that one is right there for you guys and i know a lot of people here on youtube recommend that one so i was very excited for that and then this one is in the color a japanese uh, maple and i'm pretty excited about this one as well i've been trying to really get into more nude um uh, lipsticks and lip colors because i don't know if i put it on video or not but the boyfriend he gets scared he said if it's not natural looking whatever anyway so then i stopped at shopco a couple weeks ago or a week or so ago and you guys saw on my facebook that i picked up the uh, master highlight by face studio um the maybelline highlights and this is in the color light bronze and then about five minutes after having it the uh, nude one decided to smash or i dropped it but anyway so they were 2.99 on clearance off of $9.99 at Shopco. So if you guys are looking for these or any other products in this line, I would definitely go I definitely would recommend going there and checking to see if they have them on clearance because they had other items as well. Then also from Maybelline, I picked these up as well are the color tattoos. I've never used the color tattoos before. Um, and obviously I can't hold on to them either. Uh, this one is in the color Breaking Bronze. And this is in the color Pink Rebel. And I have them on my lids today, um, along with two other colors that will, I will show you. And I really, I like them. They're different. And then I also got these. This is all out of my element, you guys, but I'm going to try it. Um, this is in the color uh, Tough as Taupe. And it's a lot darker than I thought it would be. I don't know why I thought it would be um, a little bit lighter, but... I obviously wasn't paying attention and this one is called um, electric blue and these are the metal lines um, they're interesting I will uh, definitely have to play around with these because like I said they're out of my element I can see myself wearing them in the fall with maybe like a sweater of some sort but yeah it's definitely not me so I guess we'll have to see 
And then I did pick up some L'Oreal Infallibles. Uh, this is in the Amber Rush. And this is in the Glistening Garnet. And those are on my lid as well. I can't wait to pick up more. I really, really absolutely love these. Um, and then I saw that they are coming out with the eyeshadow pencils. No, just the regular eyeliner pencils. So I'm really excited to try those as well. Well, um, I know you guys have seen this all over the place. It's the Miss Manga. I've had it for about a month now. I absolutely, absolutely love this for my mascara. Um, I'm very, 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 very pleased with it. Um, it has a 360 uh, bristle. It is amazing. If you guys haven't uh, picked it up yet, I definitely would. And then from L'Oreal, I also picked up um, the Soft Peach and the Soft Pink. Uh, these are the cream blushes that are new and recent and a little goes a long way so I don't know what I'm doing but anyway um I really really like these I rub these in with my bronzer but you can see the texture is just light and gentle and that's what I like to put on my cheeks because otherwise they get dried out fairly easily um and then I was looking for the Rimmel almond cream to brighten up my eyes and I only kept finding this nude pencil but I found it and I really really like it and last but not least I got an eyelash curler from Target and that was like a dollar something with my coupons so that was my high end other end uh, makeup haul thanks for watching my video and you guys have a nice day